Hey gang, FLX Beer Reviews, back with another episode of oh boy. <laughs> As the Beer Swirls. We're getting into it today. Uh, I'm Dan. <laughs> I'm Mike. Dan, I love the look of this beer. What are we drinking? Yeah, so let's just take a... Can we like, take like a moment said, to look at it's this? It's like a bunch of like tattoos and like a, I really a, like a cave the wall or something. Look and, at that. Yeah. It's okay. fantastic. Uh, Tell me about it. So this is a beer called Not Good Behavior. Ooh. And this is a double New England IPA, okay. 8.2 ABV, mm. brewed by Widowmaker Brewing in collaboration Ooh. with Thin Man Brewery. Thin Man. So Widowmaker, it says it South Shore, head. Buffalo, Thin Man. All right. You know. Uh, let's see. Where, how did we come across this? Well, we'll, uh, we'll get there. We'll get there. Oh, Simmer sense. down. Story time's not over. Brewed Ooh, and more. canned by Widowmaker Brewing. Okay. In Braintree... Massachusetts. Isn't that the greatest? That sounds like a town I should own. It's the most presumptuous. Yes. So this was canned on... There's Ooh, not a can... So oh, oh, there it is. Whoa, it's inside. Hey, Whoa, hey, I was about hey, to bring you right. down, throw dirt in you your face. You know what? We're back up. We've got a can yes. on date. What uh, do we got? 5 2022 So we're Wonderful. about a month and a half out. Yep, we're good. Uh, what is cool about this is... You know, we live in the western New York area, so we we're do. obviously used to seeing Thin Man. So when I first saw it, I was like, oh, Thin Man collab with Widowmaker. But then I got looking, I was like, no, no, this is a Widowmaker oh, beer. Yeah, Widowmaker. With Thin Man. Yeah, 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 all right. So, where did you get I, this? I got this at, well, now it's Quickly's. I'm but, unfamiliar. Uh, craft beer at Dia Prima's. Oh, Dia Prima's. Over, over in Fairport, New York, they had a single of it. So, great. In the Whirlpool. Uh huh. Citra and Mosaic. Okay. Then they double dry hopped it with Raku and Galaxy. Why would they do such a thing? Or is it Raiku, Raku, Raku? Ryu? Ken? Rakao. Ken and Ryu. Rakko's Modern Life. Hadouken! Rakko's Modern Life. Rakko's Modern uh, Life. And then they threw some more Citra and Mosaic in. Heifer. Filbert. The Big Heads. There you go. <laughs> okay, well that looks delicious. How many Thin Man beers do you drink? Give it a little. Yeah, worry, make sure. It. Yeah, there you go. Hold on, hold on. No, I like to give you the last drabs of it. Thanks. Because I'm a, I'm a thoughtful friend. Thanks um, for giving me the drags. So, it looks like an easy IPA. It with really an does. Insanely full, compact, bubbled, yes. soap sudsy head. It looks. A couple what, little carbonation what, bubbles. Uh, get in on. here, Mike. Get in here. Get in here, buddy. We're going to get in here. Yeah. Get in here. Ah! All right. Uh, a couple little legs. It's lacing the glass nicely. Yeah. Like, it looks like a solid double IPA. Get a whiff. Let's do it. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Well, that's playing games. Oh, my goodness. Don't you play games with my heart. Wow, that's pineapple for days. Um, pineapple, mango, mango and um, no, there's something else there, like star fruit. There's something. Like that. Don't just pull ripe star fruit. No, here. like seriously, no. I remember except bought star fruit, passion fruit, maybe. That was like a star fruit thing. <laughs> you okay? You're hung up on star. Fruit. It's star fruit, dude. I boy, had... I get. No, seriously, I. I'm I well it. aware of how much Cutting star fruit is. is so weird, by the way. You feel like you're killing something, yes, right? Yes, I do. Yeah, okay. And there's a... a Man, there's a, a fruity <sighs> funk. There's... I'm, okay. There's a bready kind of pastry aspect to it. Okay. Yeah, like the a bready malt <sighs> character. Like a, like a uh, fruit... A multiple fruit pie. Hmm. It smells fantastic, though. Like Loganberry? Oh, Loganberry. Garbage play. Charlie's. Let's dive into it. Okay. Cheers. First Widowmaker on the channel, by the way. It is. Our, uh, <sighs> our buddy over at uh, Get a Nose on our brew reviews, Rajopolis. Yep. I think he's had a few Widowmakers. He talks about them. Has he? Yeah, I think so. 
Oh, they doubles and triples? Cause I, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I, I don't know about this. Really? Ooh, that's nice. I like it. It's got a nice, weird-esque thing that I don't usually get. Okay. Tell me about it. So, we're right off the rip. Okay. Body is a medium all day. Uh, sweet candy on the front of the lips. Then goes through, and you start get your tongue stripped by this citra tropical chalkiness. And then on the back, there's this this like I said, this weird like like not weird, but like a, it's a non like it's star fruit kiwi. Um, a Pacific Coast fruit. Yeah. Like a... Oh, man. What was that... What was that fruit called? It looks like the tomato. I had you try it here. Oh, my Oh, gosh. my gosh. Per, oh. Permission. Permit... Per, uh, yeah. Is it permissions? Permissions? Like Japanese permissions? They look like tomatoes. Those were so good. But you're supposed to, like... Uh, ripen them all the way until you they're like, like a yogurt. You, yeah, basically, you you leave your fingerprints in the. Fruit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's got that that pop to it. That like that, it's got that like almost, almost if you took like a, a lemon starburst and mix it with the orange starburst, that's kind of the pop I'm getting. It's got a rotten, overripe fruit aspect that I don't particularly care for. Okay. That I get in other beers that is complimentary. Rotten, rotten pear? No, it's like rotten, like, peach. Okay. Like, and, and I get it in other beers that I enjoy. Rotten or just, like, to the point it's, of... It's overripe slash rotten. <laughs> and for... It's not... Sort doable. of like if we had to do some banana form, like, uh, we should probably throw these bananas away, but I could still use that in banana bread. Like that. Yeah, that yeah. Stage You're looking at a, in a the life overripe rotten fruit. Well, yeah. in the life of a rotten fruit, welcome to Widowmaker and Thin Man. <laughs> uh, the, the, there's pineapple and passion fruit. Um, okay, I'm getting like peach. Th there's okay. like overripe peaches. Like it's like a lemon tea thing to it. Oh, I can't get past that. Like you don't like it? No, I do not. Okay. All right. Let's uh, let's rate it then. I'll tell you what, I'll go. Go for it. I give it a four. I enjoy it. Okay. It's solid for like a, a, a first foray, first time, first trip, first experience with the Widowmakers. Uh, I've hit Thin Man, obviously. Thin Man is. They're, Thin Man, they're, they're, they're readily to me, available. They're, they're readily available. Obviously, we're in Western New York, but they're sort of a hit and miss kind of brewery for me. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, I'll have like a really good IPA from them. Mm -hmm. And then I have one on my key. There, let me put it this way. There's a metric crap ton of Bill's themed beers in the area. Yeah. The Thin Man Pills Mafia is one of my least favorite ones. Oh, okay. Um, as far as what they're trying to go for... He's a resurgence fella. Oh, dude, they're Buffalo-style IPA. That's freaking killer. Um, as Buffalo far style. as what... The it's a whatever, fucking idea. Whatever that is. Uh, as far as what they're going for, uh, I, I'm going to split this up like we've talked about before. Beer wise, I'll give it a four. Okay. Personal preference, two five maybe. I really wow. Like I really don't like it. Holy at all. shit! Well, don't take another sip then. A two. It just smells bad. I, I don't, know. I don't I, know. I don't care for this one. Okay, I don't know where to go. There. This one. I love the label art. Okay. Love what they're trying to do. Nah, it's not for me. Okay. All right. You heard it first here on uh, FLX Beer Reviews. Uh, down seconds. description below, <laughs> untapped FLX Beer Reviews. And no, my untapped is untapped. <laughs> Twitter, Instagram, <laughs> FLX Beer Reviews, YouTube, FLX Beer click Reviews. Click on shit. Whatever. I don't know. Just type in, in Google FLX Beer Reviews. It, hopefully our visages come up. Yes. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. <laughs> Cheers. Might as well have been a resurgence. Oh, that would have been.